hope you know what all them souls about. We gon' keep it active, we gon' do a lot of running miles. Real cute bitch, nasty ass attitude. You ain't getting money, why the fuck you think I'm stunned? Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. It's your girl Sherry. And I'm back with another video. And as you can tell by the title, it's a makeup must have for oily skin. Yes, brown girl friendly. <laughs> And I will be telling you what exactly that I use on my face. Okay, I got a list. <laughs> so hold on now. I don't want to miss anything. So I'm going to start with my brows because that's exactly what I start with. Always with my brows. I want to go a close, close up. As you can tell. There is my brows. This is like hours since I've done it. For my brows, I use the Benefit Brow Pencil. This will be some high-end and some um, low-end products. So that will be a mix in this video, just to let you know. I will be doing another video for low-end products, things that works best, so you guys could check that out as well. It's a high-end Benefit Brow Pencil in the number five. Yeah, I have like black hair, but I don't want my brows extremely black, so it's like a black brown. I glue down glue gorilla glue no 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 <laughs> this is safe for the brows this is the nyx um the brow gel yes oh i said brow gel this is the brow glue i love it i usually just get some of the products get some of it off and then flick my hairs up eye for eye base and carving out underneath my brow i use a concealer which is the deep in Tarte. Then for the eye base, I either use this, the P. Louise base. In number four, as you can tell, I have eyeshadow on today. So I use the P. Louise base for my eyeshadow. But to carve out my brow, I'm always using my Tarte concealer in D. I have another concealer. <laughs> which I put underneath my eye. I use these two concealers. Oh my gosh, when I tell you these two concealers, when I tell you, I love the thickness of these concealers because I'm able to use a small amount and let it dry up a bit and then smooth out underneath my eyes. Mascara, I do love my MAC mascara in this in extreme dimension. So there you go. And I like this because it's very, 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 very black. It gets underneath over here because the bristles are small and I'm able to get my lashes to elongate. My next one is primer. Let's get into the face. My primer. I am oily. When I say oily, oil. Working on an oil farm, whatever factory, oil factory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bigger than Hess oil. I don't know, whatever. So, Smashbox Oil and Shine Control. Oil and Shine Control, love it. Definitely smooths out my pores, smooths out my skin. Gives it a great canvas for my makeup. To stick on and stay on and smooth. So, so for the oily girls, you need this. I always rave about it since the beginning of my channel since BC, <laughs> since the beginning of my channel, I rave about this foundation. If you don't know, now you know. Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. All day wear. This is an all day stay in place makeup, okay? This makeup is staying in place. I remember when I used to work at a counter, I would have my makeup on all. Beginning of the morning, and then all the way throughout, when, if I would go out, it stayed on and people would compliment me like oh my gosh oh wow i love your makeup i love your makeup i'm like yeah yeah thank you thank you oh and then i said yeah i did this morning this morning yes this morning <laughs> i love this foundation it's, just, it's very 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 full coverage so if you're if you like simple light this might not be for you this is for the oily full coverage need that face filtered filtered in person so i love this foundation always will use it i try to use different foundation 
just doesn't work for me. So whatever works for you, stick with it. If you could, you know, change it up, change some things, tweak some things in your makeup, and there you go. This is a star. I, I, if I have to pick three, I'm going to pick three main products that I would definitely say get it. The other products, you could just like change it out and get something else, you know. But this, this, write it down. Put a star. Put a star. This is the Lori L'Oreal. Ooh. Sorry, girl, Miss Thang. I don't know who that is. <laughs> this is the Laura Mercier translucent, 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 translucent honey. It says on the bottom there. I love the honey one. I have the I have this one in deep, but I barely use deep anymore. I use the deep for my lid space, but this, if you want a highlighted smooth under eye. Well, y'all just seen that. There you go. Y'all just see me dump it over for the sake of this video. So you might as well like this video. It gives it a thumbs up. You might as well share it because I'm making a mess. You may see the beauty right here. <laughs> Behind the scene. Mm -mm. Anyways, so next thing I must have for bronzer. Oh my gosh. Oh my lord <laughs> i love this bronzer i did not get to the powder yet for the all over the face i should have but it's okay we're gonna get there my favorite bronzer of right now and bobby forever miss miss charlotte tilbury she did her thing there you go i love it it's just like the brown like you hello subtle subtle capital s but maybe actually lowercase s yes i love that bronzer the next star put 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 10 stars next to this this next one pro filter foundation soft matte fancy <laughs> yes a pro filter soft matte powder foundation in shade 410 i'm in the shade 410 Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't tell y'all. The Estee Lauder foundation is in sandalwood. If anyone could look at my skin on camera right now and think that I'm, we might be the same shade. Yeah, then that's the shade. When I use my bronzer, I did I do liquid and then powder. So since I introduced you to the powder, let me introduce you to the the contour shade that I use underneath it, which is the ColourPop. Ooh. ColourPop foundation stick in deep dark contour 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 it does not give you that harsh line and you're just blending and blending like oh my gosh why did i put too much i don't have time that right there you just it's just just blendable just like blends in and i use it as my nose contour as well i absolutely love 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 that product lush uh, mac it's called raisin well you know yeah sometimes makeup don't stay together you know but this i love for our melaninated skin it pops up on the skin perfectly my lips lip liner that i use is the chestnut lip liner by mac just a nice brown lip liner go around and today this was my look my chocolate look i had to got my nails done yeah just chocolate all over my two most favorite setting sprays at the moment are airbrush flawless setting spray party all night stay all day by charlotte tilbury but i spray this first and then last for the oil control yes urban decay d slick and this says makeup setting spray oil control my favorite lash glue if you have sensitive eyes use the lash glue that has no latex and no formulae and so far i've been using it for three days now eyes don't do not hurt do not itch do not burn amazing i'm glad i figured it out because i've been using the other ones and my eyes were getting puffy um rash on my eye it was like it was it was a hot mess and then i realized wait you are allergic to latex 
get it together. So that was my makeup must have. Basically, I brought you guys into what I use on a daily basis and that's my makeup stash. So I'm putting you on. Stay with me, stay with me. Tell me what's your favorite product that you've used over the years or what you looking to use and any question about makeup, go ahead, comment down below. I'll be happy to help, happy to answer your questions. And yeah, the everything will be in the description box if you want to go check it out. You can get it either at Sephora, Ulta, Ulta for the points, you know? Yeah. I will see y'all in the next video, okay? And my favorite saying, <laughs> stay with me, slay with me.